Hello, fellow humans, and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Repentance here. Uh, we've gotten our third win on a mom's heart, which is excellent, excellent. And um, I don't know if that actually came from the challenge or not, but last time we did do the pitch black challenge. Next up is highbrow, so let's uh, let's go for it and see what this is all about. Uh, we are a big poop monster. This is actually really gross, but... um. <laughs> We'll see how it goes. We've got flush, which turns all enemies in the room to poop. And uh, we've got number one, which like to shoot fast, but have low range. And then we've got some butt bombs, which are bombs that uh, do some damage to everyone in the room. Yeah, basically how it goes. Uh, I am. I don't think we get any item rooms. And so we're just gonna have to rock this all the way to what looks like mom. So not mom's heart, but just mom. And uh, yeah. Figure out how it works. Uh, you know, I'm feeling like this isn't the best. <laughs> we oh, we also have um, whatever this is the um the poop item, our trinket, and I am unsure as to what that poop item does. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah. No wait, no, the fossilized poop. I know what it does. Fossilized poop is um, you get more items from breaking poops with your tears. That's what that does. Absolutely. What I didn't know what did is um, the transformation. We're like super poopy right now. And I am unsure as to the reason that is. <laughs> I know that is like a transformation of some sort, but I don't know exactly what it does. And then I totally forgot about our last and uh, fourth item, which is E. coli. And E. coli makes it so when we touch enemies like this, they turn into poops. Very, very nice just like to have against enemies that don't deal contact damage to us or like if we get hit by something, we'll be able to like, you know, defend ourselves a little bit. Uh, picking up Maggie's doll, increasing our range a little bit, which is actually really, really nice because with number one, our, our damage or not our damage, our range is really, really bad. Gonna use flush here just because it was up and ready to go. And uh, I hate those enemies that charge at us. <laughs> Simple as that. Simple as that. We found our boss. Ooh, we found our boss room super duper early, which is nice. We'll just uh, send it, I guess. Picking up some extra hearts and we'll be on our way here. Maybe getting uh, a deal with the devil would be nice. You know, it could absolutely change the, like, the way that we play this challenge. Wow, it just destroys. Oh, Binky. Great pickup for us, I guess. Um, I, I'm going to take both of these just to like, for fun, because, <laughs> uh, with the current items that we have, like, we're actually pretty strong and like, we're not going to be able to get any, uh, paralysis. We're not going to be able to get any like items anyway. So we'll try to maximize the amount of items that we can get from like the sources that we have. So boss rooms and, um, devil deals in that way. Ooh, this could be good. It was not good, but hey, it could have been. We'll just turn these guys into poops. We'll flush these guys. <laughs> and we just got a one wave to deal with. Much makes the, our lives a lot easier on this uh, challenge room. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Let me pick up some, uh, some of these coins that we're getting. We might get enough coins to uh, make our shop viable. Get something from there. I don't know, something would be good. <laughs> anyway, poop that guy. I don't think you hurt us. You do hurt us. Okay, so the ones that walk around do in fact hurt us, but the ones that are stationary do not hurt us. Uh, good to know. That is good to know. And uh, we can just kill them like any other enemy. Oh, aha. Okay, we're good. We're good, we're good. And we can continue on. Excellent poop room. <laughs> uh, it might be nice to try to save the poop for a boss if there's like a, a poopy boss. I don't know if we can get a poopy boss. I know there's a poopy boss on like, well, I guess every single one on the dross, which is like a new floor that was added in Repentance. Um, but ooh, less than three is a great pickup here. I guess a heart, less than three, whatever you want to call it. Just an extra health. Yikes, okay, that's fine. <laughs> but we didn't, uh, we didn't lose our, you with the devil chance. Still at 36% of a chance to get the with the devil. All right, that room's pretty easy if you just destroy the poops in the center. Knocks them all out. 
and that you don't have to worry about the uh, individual flies that way. Very nice. All right, if we find our shop, we're going to be a very happy camper. We do have more than 15 cents, and uh, speak of the shop, and it will appear. Nice. That's not really great for us. <laughs> you know what? Maybe, maybe, maybe. I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it just to have, and then, like, if we end ourselves, if we get ourselves more money on the next floor, like, we don't need as much to make the shop viable for us, you know. It'll be it'll be fine. All right, that was bad positioning on my part. We're fighting um, we're fighting P with poop and P. This is disgusting. I'm <laughs> just I just am just realizing how disgusting this is. <laughs> it is it's it is truly just gross, <laughs> in all senses of the word. All right, any good here? We got some pills. Paralysis gives us a demon heart, which is good. Luck down is totally fine. Luck down for a damage up, I'll take that any day. We're not going to be really using luck too much. And we've got, um, we've got the poop. we got the fossilized poop or whatever. Paralyzed poop. So we're going to increase items anyway from uh, poop-related destruction. <laughs> oh, mysterious candy. Fart or spawn poop every 30 seconds. That'd be very fitting, but unfortunately, I can only carry one trinket. So I think uh, the paralyzed poop in this case is better for us. In the long run, at least. All right, this is an excellent flush. No doubt on my mind. And look at all of the things we're getting from poops. So good. Very, very nice. All right. <laughs> we're very, very healthy. We've got good damage. And I'm feeling really, really good about this. Uh, I think mom is going to be an absolute pushover. <laughs> Especially if we, like, stockpile a couple of bombs. She's not going to stand a chance against us. It's going to be glorious. Absolutely glorious. All right. Easy room, easy life. Uh, we'll try to find our item room if we can. Because we do have steam sale, um, eight coins is enough to get an item. That was very, very bad positioning on my part, but that's fine. Use flush, and we're good to go. <laughs> we're actually making, like, fantastic time. It's actually, like, really, really fast, the way that we're going through this game so far. It's, like, only been seven and a half minutes. Like, yeah, six and a half minutes on this run, and we're already on the caves part two. It is incredible. Uh, I wish I had flush for this floor, for this room, but whatever. <laughs> we use it on a pretty good room, and we got the most out of it, at least. Knights, coins, hop into here. Booster pack spawns five random cards. I guess I'll take it. You know, it's not like it could be bad for us. What did you get? It's two of hearts. Uh, okay, that does nothing for us. Double active. Oh, I like that. We got the devil, the fool, and another fool card. Okay, we'll take the uh the question mark card. It allows us to use um the flesh twice in one room, or like just so we could use it whenever good overall good overall i'm just gonna use the flush here because i don't like that room <laughs> and it'll, it'll also speed things up as we uh progress through here uh there is an invisible enemy which is annoying to try to deal with i guess it's not invisible rune shard activates a random rune effect the rune effect is weaker and that was algas it didn't really do very much for us can i flush you Flushing you does nothing. Okay, good to know. Good to know. <laughs> uh, our our short range here is a bit of a problem against Gertie Jr., but uh, we managed to eke it out, and we get some dessert as our win prize, and we're good to go. Nice. And uh, on this floor, we should have guaranteed deal with the devil as long as we uh, don't get hit, and uh, hopefully we can actually, you know, have that happen. Very, very, like, likely. Just because we have so many soul hearts, it's the likelihood that we're gonna be, like, hit all the way down is, like, basically nothing. Black Tooth. Randomly shoot poison tooth tears. It's a good, it's a good trinket. Don't get me wrong, but... Ooh, okay, I'm just gonna bomb them. Give them a stun effect so I can actually get in there and do some damage. All right. Good, good, good. Uh, we'll check out the shop as well. We got greed, which is uh, not something you want to see, but all right. <laughs> not that hard either. We got hit once. 
no big deal, no big deal. We uh, get compensated for that with a lot of coins. Look at that, nice. We've got a tinted rock over here for more health and an extra bomb. What does this do? Reroll and restart the current floor. Um, sure. Oh, stapler, let's go. Um, I guess we'll restart the current floor. Why not? <laughs> I don't see like why you wouldn't want to do this. We've already visited our shop. I guess we could have, I, okay, you know what? I guess we could have fought the boss and then come back. That way we could have gotten an, an extra like boss item. Okay, I think that was the proper play and we just didn't do the proper play. <laughs> I was, I wanted to get the guy uh, and run into him, but I ran into the fly that he spawned, unfortunately. Am I immune to these little poops with the poop transformation? Is that what it does? I mean, they still charge at me. I'm gonna run into this guy. Nope, I still get hit. I have no clue what this poop transformation does. I don't even think it does anything. Like, at all. <laughs> anyway, I digress. I digress. Ooh, oh, you thought? Oh, good dodging, good dodging. We're, we're doing it, we're doing it. Magician, may you never miss your goal. It allows us to have uh, homing tiers for a single room. And uh, you know how much I like my homing tiers. I like it a lot. <laughs> uh, still in the depths part one, but we're making excellent, excellent time. If, uh, you know, if we make it to like 20 minutes on this uh, on this particular run and we beat mom by 20 minutes i found pills no effect it doesn't even spawn a black heart sag oh <laughs> a little actually like funny i wasn't expecting the um, the rainbow poop to go off but lo and behold it did it did i'm just gonna poop these guys i cannot poop them repeat i cannot poop them <laughs> Or I get flesh them is the proper verbiage there. Give me a key. No key. Come on, man. We'll use the uh, the magician card. Uh, yikes. We'll use the magician card just to make our lives a little bit easier. <laughs> Loki thought it was a real good idea to just pop in the corner there. And I guess it was. I couldn't do anything about it. All right. Got kind of, kind of nine tails for a damage up. We're looking real strong. Uh, I found pills that does nothing and then health down. I mean, I guess Book of Belial is really, really strong. And I guess dark matter is too for the damage up. Mm. All right, I'll take I'll take dark matter. And then I'll take this health down pill as well. Now we got crazy damage. Our damage is actually like really, really good. <laughs> and we've got strong tier rate. We've got like decent enough range. It's not great. It's not great, but it's decent enough. And that's all that matters. Um, Unfortunately, we got a golden chest out of that tinted rock and uh, we don't have any keys. We now have keys. <laughs> that's actually really good. That was a great chest. And uh, I'm lucky that I was uh, able to obtain a key. Flush is back online. And you know what? Just just, just use it here. <laughs> I don't have to deal with those jumping enemies. Like, actually the worst. 100% actually just the worst. Hey, shop. Please don't be greed. I am asking you to, like, listen and not be greed, please. Cursed skull is terrible. It's greed. Ugh, are you kidding me? Oh, the last shop we could possibly go to. Come on, man. Just trying to have some fun on this challenge. But no. You gotta fight greed twice, even though you have so many coins. <sighs> maybe it was uh maybe it was greedy to assume that I could just go in there and buy something. This uh fear shot is actually like pretty decent. Like, I, before, I feel like the, the fear shot was just terrible because you couldn't, like, predict anything that was going to happen. But I feel like they've made it actually pretty good. Uh, the poop, like, spawns on the, the platforms here, and I wasn't expecting it to. I thought it was just going to be, like, over the pit, but nope. And we get our fight against Mom. It's going to be a pretty easy one, especially with the chariot card. We can just run into enemies. 
Okay, it didn't last very long. <laughs> and in fact, I think we're doing more damage with our tears than we did with the chariot card. That's really, really funny. Maybe we can get mom to stomp on us right here and open this tinted rock. I'm just, okay, I'm just gonna use a bomb. <laughs> That way we don't just like have to sit there and not deal any damage while mom just keeps spawning enemies. Get out of the way of the hands and we're good. Okay. Actually super duper solid. Come on. Stomp on me, mom. Don't take that out of context. <laughs> uh, and this, uh, this challenge, you know, I it didn't really feel like a challenge that much as like, I don't know. It didn't feel that much like difficulty wise. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed uh, watching me just breeze through that challenge super duper fast. And uh, I hope this video made your day just a little bit better. I'm PAC and as always, take care.